Workers are trying to rehabilitate nearly 400 dogs taken from a hoarder in Georgia. Police arrested the woman responsible earlier this week. Now, animal rescue groups are focused on caring for those dogs. Tracy Leong explains how Maryland nonprofit is getting involved. Hundreds of shepherds have been rescued from the Georgia case, and a lot of them came right here to the Mount Airy Rescue Center, and now they need the public's help to raise more than $120,000. Living in deplorable conditions, some covered in their own feces. Video from the Atlanta Humane Society shows hundreds of abused German shepherds found at an illegal breeding operation in Georgia. Unbelievable. Some of these dogs were beaten with a shovel. Board president of the Mid Atlantic German Shepherd Rescue, Candy Myers, has joined other animal care groups in the fight to save these dogs. Feeding off of other dogs that were dying or dead. Um, and there's multiple bite, bite wounds on all of them. They all seem to have skin infections and various injuries uh, that we will definitely be treating. Showing signs of physical and emotional distress. Volunteers in Mount Airy are focused on rehabilitating these dogs, getting them the proper medical treatment and attention they need. We just want to get them everything that they need. We want to get them food. We want to get them some affection, some personal attention, and uh, put them in homes. Providing these dogs the best care possible for a second chance at life. Next week, they're expecting to get at least 26 more dogs from the Georgia case, and they still need about $120,000 to help with their care. I'm Tracy Leong reporting in Mount Airy for WJZ.